Hello everyone, welcome back to another Minecraft Maze episode, and today I'm going over the speed build that I did for um, Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, I did that recently today, but this is part two. Uh, I did this way later in the day, like right now, by the time I'm saying, uh, like recording this audio. It's late, that's all I'm gonna say. Um, it's not midnight, but it's late. Uh, the the bottom of the islands for Tears of the Kingdom are built in a really weird way. Like it's not anything like a normal sky island. So it, it's very fun mapping out this entire area, but um, it's certainly not bad either because I don't really know. I found a lot more fun. In building the actual main buildings of the island instead of the landscape. Mainly because I have to fill in each of these little areas with stone. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's very fun. The most annoying part is, though, um, is doing the deep slate. In my opinion, deep slate's the closest color to the outside of the island. And if I could show a screenshot, I would, but I, I mean, I can't. But Deep Slate is very close to what it actually looks like. If it had a little splotch of brownish yellow in there, it would be better, probably. But Flux Construct Island, very easy. It's kind of It kind of looks man-made, and I feel like that's kind of what they were going for in Tears of the Kingdom. I mean, if you know the story, you know the story of how the Skylands got up there, but... Um, yeah... Um, I had good fun building the, uh, island after this point, because I wasn't just gonna continuously place blocks going upward. Also, the audio for the group, or the, for the voice chat area for the previous video I uploaded did not work. So yeah, I also continued to teleport constantly. So, it was very, it was very fun. Um, as you can see, I'm just building up the outside of the island. I had to check if the grass went over the edge or not. It didn't, which is why I'm building this part. Uh, honestly, the height's very cool, and honestly, the size is very nice. The snow island I built previous to this was definitely not big enough. It was... A little too small. I'm going to fix that because I'm not gonna redo that island because it's already it's already a good size. The next area, the next part is the pond that you land in at the start of the game. Uh, very cool. But um, yeah, I struggled a lot with this part. I don't even know why. It shouldn't even like it should not have been that difficult i'm also choosing orange grass over yellow because yellow has already been used in my map and i don't want to keep the same color i want to keep everything a little bit different for sand sand is sand so i don't really know what else you would use like red sand i'll probably eventually get a speed build for that or for like a mesa biome i don't really know though after this part, I look at what's in game. I killed the flux construct because it respawned, not because of blood moon. As you can see, just a little over thing. This is when I kill it. Uh, I find out underneath it is a little splotch of more orange grass, and I think orange is very fitting with the color. Like he, I feel like if more people built the Great Sky Island, it would be more yellow. But I kind of like the custom look of the orange because sure like the trees have yellow leaves and i'm gonna do that but or not gonna do that but i kind of like the idea of having it as orange because it's different and it also looks a little bit better in my opinion of course i could have used a little like red sand splotches in there but i feel like red sand is too orange for red sand but honestly for 
the orange wool color. It's too, uh, too red for me, too dark of an orange. As you can see, there's the eye of the flux construct. Uh, if you haven't played Tears of the Kingdom, uh, this doesn't relate, but you know. Uh, but yeah, about done, and there we go. I'm going to fill in the rest of the area. But yeah, that's about it. Um, a little showcase coming in. Uh, there's some things I didn't build on camera on it, but yeah. But yeah, here we go. As you can see, just doing the little overview. It's directly above the Savannah School area, so very fun. But yeah, if you like this video, please like and subscribe. I will be continuing this build and continuing speed builds. Net the n final week of my story is tomorrow, so very excited for that. Goodbye.